How does a level of effort activity pick up its actuals? And how do I get percent complete, especially physical percent complete, for level of effort activities? That's what I want to talk about in this tutorial. So let's have a look at this simple project I've built. It has three activities, all with finish to start relationships. There's my critical path. And then I have a level of effort activity here, the project management activity. And you can see down here, I've actually assigned a project controls person to that activity. Now, I want to show you how the level of effort is set up. It's set up with a start to start relationship to the excavate activity. So that allows the level of effort activity to pick up its start date from the excavate activity. And it has a finish finish relationship in the successor area with a the build activity in that it allows it to pick up the finish date from build and the start date from uh, excavate. And that's what level of effort activities do. They pick up start and finish dates from their predecessors and successors and they have an auto calculated duration. So if these activities expand, the duration of the level of effort will expand as well. Now, how do we get actuals and how do we status that level of effort activity? Well, it's much easier than you think. Level of effort activities actually pick up status from the activities that they quote unquote summarize. So I say that this level of effort is summarizing these three activities. Let's have a look. So let's go ahead and status our excavate activity. Let's mark it started. Let's indicate that we've done 20% of this work and that there's four days left. I'll go ahead and reschedule the project, moving my data date forward one day. Move it over here to the Monday. And what you should see now is that we have actuals up here on Excavate and we have actuals picked up here on the project management activity. So a level of effort activity picks up its actual information from those activities as well, the ones that it summarizes. Now in this situation, notice the level of effort activity has a physical percent complete set. And that's very common to be used in construction in oil and gas industry. We like to use physical percent complete. So you can see here that it has a duration percent complete of 6.67%, but it actually has no physical percent complete set because when I use physical percent complete, I need to manually status that field. In the previous tutorial I did, go and have a look, where we set this to duration percent complete, the activity automatically gets calculated its own percent complete, not with physical. So here with physical, we would have to update this on our own. So perhaps this is, you know, five, maybe let's say 6% complete. And when I enter that field in, we'll now see it displayed up here. Now, if you're using earned value and you want to track earned value on a level of effort, you'll need to use your physical percent complete in the most optimal settings. So hopefully this tutorial was helpful for you. How do you get physical percent complete on a level of effort and how does a level of effort calculate its actuals? Thanks.